tight. Corrupted machines. Patrolmen, guards. They're like soldiers. Held in reserve for war yet to come. You'll have to get past them. This is the easy way in? The back way in. I didn't say it would be easy. Thank you. Thank you for calling me out, Iris. Not much gets past them. Oh, I thought it I thought I alerted them. But I guess immediately losing sight of me. That works. So uh, let's, uh, let's try and start this um, in a more favorable position. Let's see what's through here. Corrupted machines. Is A1 a kind of... Because it makes me think of, of, of language tests. You'll have to get past them. That has letter grade kind of thing. I didn't see it. That's weird. These guys seem to have gotten an upgrade. It used to be with the heavy, I could two shot them in the eye. Ooh, that is not the right weapon. Thank you. 
Ow, 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 something ain't meaning something. I think I saw a thing for my spear? Wait, but my spear doesn't have upgrades. Spear damage coil. So what? Circles. Circles. Wait, what? Do I need to unlock the ability to modify my spear? That's annoying. It must be must be one of the spear upgrades, which I get the feeling might be side quests, because that one spear upgrade I do have was from a uh, side quest. Well, slack. I'll just have to deal with it. Sounds like they're doing some blast mining or weapons testing. Come on, you can climb that. Alloy, come on, work with me here. Suppose for completeness sake I should take out this robot. Keep quiet now. <laughs> Heavy attack. Okay. Alright, that does not do very much. But knocking out the uh, sound compression module will uh, probably finish it off. Get over here. Face me! I miss. That was a bear blow. That had a pretty big area of effect. Yikes. Wow, and he got blasted way far away. Okay, what are you... Where are you telling me to go, game? 
Do I need to climb up on one of these trees? Is what it looks like. Stocking up. Or it goes over there. Nope, can't climb here, so let's see. Rope, rope, rope. Ah, I see the yellow. Have a good lurk, Aurora. Thanks for dropping by. Always appreciate it. May your foraging be bountiful. Explosions in the distance. Pay them no mind. Doesn't concern you. No, no, I, I find I find explosions to be exceedingly concerning. Can I jump? Oh, this is another way to have climbed up there, I think. Whatever. Yikes. Okay. Oh, no, 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 back, back, back. Oh, that has a long path to me. Really don't want to fight three of these guys though. Oh, this looks like a uh, grown over version of one of those dreadnought things that we fought a couple oh, of. Calm. I'm done waiting. Oh, that was a one-shot kill. Okay, never mind. I thought those were the huge ones that, uh... Alright, I'm, I'm mixing them up, obviously. Of course, I think it helps that I bought... I think I got both of the um, silent strike upgrades. So that's probably contributing to the, to the one-shotting. Shoot, I should have thought of that for the previous area. Traders sold 
medicinal items as the well. The just over this ridge. You'll see it when you reach the top. Now be ready to act fast. You need to get in and get it done before they raise an alarm. Here we go. Oh, cutscene time. You getting this? I see the legs of a tall neck down there, but no tall neck. Damn. What up, box? The transmitter's been moved. Check down the ravine to the left. Hope oh, your Friday has been so pretty swell. Toward the explosions. <laughs> Great. You got exactly you one boot. shot at this Aloy, so spare the sarcasm and make it count. You see that bridge over the ravine? Yep. Memorize its location. There's a rappel point on the side. That'll be your way out. And these Eclipse troopers? Avoid them or kill them, your choice. The blasting should cover any noise you make. Find the tall neck and destroy the module on top. There we go. Interesting that they basically hack the tall neck to be a, um, a cell tower for their, um, focuses. Tall G? <laughs> the machine shows no That was much closer. Slag shine glass. Interesting. Not sure what that was. Yeah, I don't want to deal with the grenadiers. You drop first. Fear the power of the shadow. No! Another grenadier! Did you shoot me from a building? Are you bloody serious, mate? Oh, you're going off the cliff. You're going off the cliff. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I almost went off the cliff. Get ready for the shadow's sting. Okay, I just... Yeah, uh, how's that how's that shadow sting turning out for you, buddy? No. It's a binding operation. So long as you're quick, it won't affect you. Oh good, another secret. What is this place? A distraction. There are several data points. As King Itaman languishes at sunfall, coddled by his mother, he will never learn the true lessons of the sun. I have tried to instruct him, but the shadow of his mother's influence is upon him. I took him to the palace balcony to behold an offering of sacrifice in the ring, but he showed no thirst for it. He averted his gaze. Look to the sun, I told him. Do not shield your eyes. In all things, it is absolute. One day, it nurtures life, and the next, scorches life away. It burns the skin of champions and wretches alike. Never does the sun show pity. That is the example a Sun King must follow. The example of your father. But before my instruction could take hold, she was there. Clutching him to her robes, burying his face against her breast. How is a king to rule when he cannot even see? My lord, the thirteenth king of the Karsha Sundom was murdered. Cut down by cowards who mistook firm rule for madness. Ever the strong 
among our best set upon by the weak. So he said, as the traitors launch their assault, as their cannons forged by Asaram filth toppled the battlements and burst the gates, I would have fought to the end. But it was his will, the will of the sun, that I lead the prince and queen into the west, to safety. My lord did not hesitate. He saw his fate. He looked into the sun, and he did not blink. With me, he sent kestrels, nobles, sun priests, and slaves. Killing all that stood in the way, I carved a path to Sunfall. There, we joined others to gather the strength to take back our home. But our strength only faded until the buried shadow was brought to light. Alright, I got if I got this some hurts. I have to mend these wounds. I have some theories, but I wanna I wanna get through the rest of the data logs first. When I first set eyes on the buried shadow, I trembled. Was I not the chosen of the sun? A blazing light of faith to shred and scatter darkness? Was it not my place to destroy this devil? But High Priest Bahavas instructed me in the prophecy, and set right my frame of mind. The murder of the true Sun King broke the cosmic cycle short of completion. The whole world cast into darkness, doomed. To resume and turn the wheel of time would require more than sun and faith. All forces must combine, all halves of nature join to one cause. Shadow to sun, night to day. Even a buried shadow wants the wheel to turn, for without a sun in the sky, there can be no shadow. When I first set eyes on the buried shadow, oh, what? I trembled. When I first set eyes on the buried shadow, Never does the sun show pity. And yet, when my wife died in birthing, and in dying into the life of my child unborn, I pitied myself. My lord sensed this, but instead of casting me down for weakness, he cast upon me a radiant beam of honor. He ordered my kin buried in the sacred caves reserved for royals and heroes. Unimaginable. Never again would I doubt that I am the chosen of the sun. Never again would pity find a place in me. Not for myself or another. <laughs> okay. So this Helis person obviously served the previous sun, Sun King, who we know was a uh he was raiding the other clans for sacrifices, because their whole thing was um, sacrificing people to kind of um, appease the machines so they wouldn't be attacked as much uh, was their thought, um, which didn't, didn't actually work. Didn't actually work. So they were overthrown. That's what he was talking about. Their king was killed. I imagine this is sort of like a shrine to that mad sun king. But it seems this guy discovered the buried shadow. And then talking about the shadow and sun joining together... I'm wondering if their zealous faith has been sort of, um, they're sort of self-justifying, you know, as a way of reckoning with their strong king being killed by these weak people. You know, their king couldn't have been wrong. No, there's no way he could have been wrong. Um, so now they're sort of becoming kind of an accelerationist cult of the machines and perhaps trying to do some sort of, or believing there's some sort of um, machine-human synthesis. Like, maybe they're, they're going to try and become, like, human vessels of machines. Like, if, if maybe they are getting, like, cyborg implants, if we're going full, um, full transhumanist, like, altered carbon kind of stuff. Um, I wonder if we might see that sort of like they have a robot mesh and the the AGI Hades is controlling their bodies through it 
Very interesting. He's a fanatic, all right. Single-minded. It gives him a focus that you seem to lack. Now, how about finding that tall neck? It would not have been easy to drag a tall neck down this path. Why bother? Just find it and get to the top. Destroy the module and then get out fast as you can. Sure is a lot of blasting up there. Sounds busy. Busy enough not to notice you, let's hope. I see it. They've built some kind of structure around it. Climb it. The sooner this is done, the better. I feel like I'm going to get to the top and there's going to be a yes. cutscene well, and it's going to pan to what all the explosions are happening at. get to the module and destroy it. Oh, because it looks like another buried... Oh, yep. Yeah. Cutscene. I see the module. Good. That'll be quick. Aloy, this is not the time. It's a battle devil. Open the module's casing, now. Aloy, do as I say or all is lost. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, fuck, Hades knows we're here. Entity has come here. Entity miscalculated. Entity cannot destroy me. I am beyond its reach. Maybe you are. That's but spooky. this isn't! Destroy the entity. Remember, always use a firewall when accessing line wire. No, I don't think Hades was very happy he stabbed him. It would have been even funnier if these were, if these were, um, um, Scandinavian, if, it, if this was, if this was Hel, Hela, and Odin, and Freyr, and all that, like, actual yeah, nerds. Think? <laughs> what do you think I'm doing? Taking a nap? Oh. Alloy just... Alloy. There's like 50 billion things for you to grab onto. Grab one of them. Bloody Tarzan that shit. There's a vine right there. Yeah, you think? Okay, maybe I gotta climb up. What do you think oh, I'm doing? Taking a nap? Wait, where the fuck do I go now? Oh. Oh. Go around. And they're wasting a lot of ammunition just to get one person. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh. Got it. Whee! Almost out of it. 
Serpentine! Yeah, Serpentine. I noticed. Keep moving or you'll die. More events ahead. A little bit left. You little bit. Oh, crap. <laughs> For a moment, they need me. Keep running. Are you kidding me? Okay, good. I didn't have to start from the very beginning. I had to check. What? Head left towards the camp. Got it. Almost out of it. Those missiles make me think of like those Nerf footballs that have like those little arrows yeah, on them. So they like have like a squealing sound effect as they move in the air. Bridge in sight. No. See ya, suckers. Ah, oh, my one weakness. Falling. As we all know. Alloy is very weak to falling damage. going but you survived you knew Hades was there and you sent me to him I won't I mean, deny you risked your life I suppose but it was the only way now with a focus network down we can both get what we want access to the secrets of zero dawn I'm past trusting you with secrets good that means you're wising up trust is for fools it shifts and crumbles like sand. A poor foundation for any partnership. But mutual self-interest. Now that is a solid bedrock upon which you and I might build a new science of understanding. We both need answers, Aloy. And thanks to you, we're on the verge of grasping them. It's unfold. We'll speak again. You know what would be a pretty crazy Sorry. twist? Dear ma'am. So that, um... What was it Helix? The the guy if I could who toss this uh, focus and be rid of you, silence, I would. really believed in the sun god. No, I need it. Sunfall it is. If I remember correctly, his wife it's died of childbirth. What if Silence is his son? And that's why he used to work for the Eclipse. But he's he's had like a, a sort of an about about face like he he no longer believes in like their their accelerationist uh join with the, the join with the machines destroy everyone else um, sort of thing but he's still kind of uh jaded which is why he's being a schmuck like he do be do be being That's my that's my later. way out of left field called shot as far as Silence's backstory. They definitely have hinted at this. What the? Whoa! Are you kidding me? We have ninja robots now. I don't like this at all. Oh. Only I can be stealthy. Uh. Oh, I'm almost dead. I 
don't even know what these are, but they make me think of like jackals or yeah. What are you? Stalker. Oh yeah, like jaguars. not doing well. I am not doing well. Oh, I love, I love, I love how these stalkers look, though. Like, oh my god. The, the hexagonal armor, the, oh, they look so sleek. Oh, I, I want to hack one so badly. I want to know if I can ride it. Because that would be a sweet bloody mount. Especially if it also made me stealthy. Their face makes me think of uh, uh, Sam Fisher. Those stealth games. Uh, the, uh, what is it, Splinter Cell? Yeah. Yeah, that's been a while. Ow. I also feel like they're pooping out grenades. Which I feel is very irresponsible. go. Alright, I think that's the last of them. I have almost no potions left. Cool, cool. This is fine. This is fine. This is perfectly fine. Oh, they're not mines. They're just flares that light up my position. Interesting. Actually, where do I need to go? I could walk there, or I could not. Thank you for the heads up. is to hide. Desert is probably more than Jack. Alright, if I quick save, it does not reload the area. No deal. Keep on running. 
draw them to us. Got your number, bird. And eight, six, seven, five, three, one, nine. Here they come. Sunfall. A mad king drowns Summer Palace. A bulwark of Cardia might against the howling Forbidden West. Thanks for the history lesson. But they have no idea what lies beneath. We will learn much from this Aloy. That's what I'm hoping. Hire sneaking around, moving out this loyalty. Sort of makes me anxious. Hmm. It's disconcerting to see so many. Is there a merchant right here? Ah, they're up in the city. Alright. It seems like a further in town. There should be some upgraded gear. They're necessities. Won't cost you a shard just to look. Perhaps they're useful Okay, so what do you got? What you got for me? Alright, not so much on that. How about weapons? Okay, I did mean I wanted to get the shotgun, basically. But I need a boar skin. Well, crap. Can I buy potions? Oh, I can just straight up buy potions. Oh, heck yeah. Amazing, amazing. Let's get that golden fast travel before I forget and accidentally sell. So now I should have free fast travel for the rest of the thing. Sure to pay dividends. Okay. Um, where's my... Don't want. I'm afraid of selling stuff that like. Oh, I can't sell them the wood. You sure, dude? I've got like almost a thousand units of it. <laughs> um, let's sell some of these. Low tier. Stuff. Or at least stuff we have like a lot of duplicates of. Yeah, this is useful. You'll regret not stopping when you're in the thick of it. The usurpers are starving us out. Plain and Right, what do we got? Oh, are we gonna have to do a gladiator arena shtick? The sun ring. The proud tradition of the It's not like a Sumerian, at least. Give them time. I'm sure they miss it. Tradition of them getting fucked up, it seems. Like, those three dudes got stomped. Now we get to see if your attack on their focus network was entirely successful. What are you talking about? Did I crash the network? Success. Welcome to the Citadel, Aloy. I'll check back with you in a moment. Citadel? Circulate. Playing Horizon Zero Dawn, not Mass Effect. If you want to hear about today's bounties, head for the throne room. You're not going to make any shards by standing out here. Filthy mercenary bottom. I'll take the shards, even if it means having a listen to Bahamas. I hear the Shadow Conjurer looking for one of the you came here to do. Very well. Understood. 
So that last city, they had a very Roman-esque armor. These people, though, they kind of make me think a little bit more, um, a little bit more samurai-esque. I love their weapons, though. I'm a sucker for pole arms. So those, um, I think it's a Bardish? Bard Bardish? I cannot pronounce it. Delicate matters to savages now. These are desperate times. Sort of a crescent axe, um, sort of thing. By the glory of the sun revealed. Well, that's a hat. Behold, radiant Edaman, the one true sun king, the light in shadow, whose will is light and whose light is law. I command Lucian Bahavas to speak in my behalf. A child emperor. By the will huh. of radiant Edaman does the sun glare down mercilessly upon the traitor Uthid. To the hunter who brings his head to us shall go a bounty of 500 shards. More prisoners than royalty, don't you think? Mm. Love your hair. Not only did the wretch conspire to you and I need to chat, Citadel, little Huntress. The green tent down in Chapel. Hey, I'll be waiting. Kind of busy. And and in doing so, demonstrated wanton disregard for the safety We both know you're no killer for hire. Uthid is innocent. So come see Go me while there's still time to save him. The will of the sun. So, the way in I spoke of is right behind you. You've got to be kidding. Not at all. And you needn't worry about the Kestrels. They'll be too busy acting important to pay attention to you. First I time in the Citadel, gotta see the sun bears. ring from on high. Well, the Kestrels. Ah. Okay. I mean, it's a side quest, but I'm intrigued. They want us Check to out what she's got to boy. say. It makes quite an impression. I hear delaying the inevitable. Besides, we made uh, we made some pretty good progress on the absolute main so quest. So it's time some for our for a little bit of break to uh, explore some of the other stories. Plus, this is a new city. The man fixes my it seems like a fairly important side quest, considering it was a uh, cutscene given one. You'll like what I have for sale, I promise. I didn't, actually. Well, no, you had health potions. Okay, I did like what you had for sale. You got me there. The food is from Dowager Queen Nasadi, little ones. Her Highness knows times are hard and helps when she can. Eat. Bring some home for your families. If you have one. I've heard whispers about you. Rides machines, fancy spear, delightful freckles. Hey, Some even say you have a conscience. <laughs> How extraordinary. Who are you? You're obviously not one of the Shadow Karja. My name is Vanasha. For now, all you need to know is that I'm a whisper of reason in this howling pit of insanity. <sighs> I know how I like that feels. I she has going on I'm under sure her you eyes. Do. And so does Uthid. He's a good man, so naturally the Shadow Karja want to murder him. It's I've done some digging, and I think paint. he's headed for the green climb. It won't take those mercenaries long to find him. He could use some help, if you're so inclined. How do you know Uthid is innocent? I'm excellent at making inquiries. Look, he feeds orphans from his own rations and personally punishes anyone who hurts the old or infirm. The idea that he would try to kill Edaman is ridiculous. He must have found something that can embarrass the priesthood. Otherwise, Bahavas wouldn't risk marking such a well-regarded man for death. What makes you think he's on the green climb? He knows he'll be pursued, so he needs a hideout that's both familiar and defensible. 
He once single-handedly held off an entire bandit clan in those foothills. My guess is that he'll fall back on what worked before. I'm wondering if he found that the priesthood is working with uh, our main antagonist peoples. I'll do what I can. Because our main antagonist peoples definitely uh, seem to be you? very. Uh, what about me? What? Fervent. What will believers. you do while I risk my life? Useful things, little huntress. Look for three dead trees south of Sunfall. They mark the start of the green climb. Good luck. Ceasefire or no, my family is starving. Avad will have to answer for that eventually. Yep, looks like, uh, New Mexico. All rocky desert and short scrub brush. I need your meat! Check where the map is pointing me. Yeah. Look, it's just the uh, circle of life. We're just traveling. Let me pick this ad back sooner. That way I don't have to worry about interrupting interesting stuff. Red light. Anything to keep those pre-rolls away. What the? Is that a mole? Oh god, it's a jar! Oh boy, have I made mistakes. buggered me up. Turkey? Oh. Hmm. I guess not. Keep that for later. Damn, that's a, that's a hell of a camp over there. All right. Need you. Yes, a boar skin. Now I can get a shotgun. Ooh, I love the rain. Ah, now this is some weather. Mm. 
Never know when I might need three dead trees. Just like Vanasha said. Let's see if Uthid came through here. These tracks lead up that rise. Must be the green climb. Ah, uh, fine. I'll just go along the path and chase down that door. I got the skin I needed anyway. How is this guy supposed to know I'm a friendly? Like, is, um, who is it, Vanessa? Is she gonna send like a pigeon ahead? Be like, hey, this redheaded woman's gonna be coming up to you. She's cool. Foot tracks up here. Time to climb. Okay, let's not let's not fall. jump across? Do I need to climb up over here? A little bit unclear here. Those look like yellow, like they want me to climb. Hmm, maybe I need to just jump to this. Yep, okay. I don't like taking those leaps of faith. This game does not make it very obvious where it wants me to climb. And it's not permissive enough for me to know I can climb almost anywhere. Like, if I could be reasonably sure that any, like, reachable ledge is something I could climb on, that would be one thing. All right, back on the trail. Food scraps. I'll bet Uthid stopped to see if he was being followed. He must have kept going. I've got to catch up. Okay, we've been up the green trail. Now we go back down the green trail. You know, usually you don't want to climb up a mountain then down it. You kind of want to get onto. A and machine. even slope Uthid's and just hunting. go around because going up and down inclines drains your energy useful has been stripped. much much faster Uthid's been gathering components Birds at this is snakest. Got you. Oh. At least they're glint hawks, not glint mongeese.
down here where I can shoot you. Cowards. Where do you go from here? Well, there goes all the medicine I've been building up. Down a ravager. Not an easy kill, but they good for the parts. Dead watchers. More scrap for Uthid's stockpile. And he's just cutting a swath through these robots. This dude knows how to hunt. Are you. Are you. Alloy, I know you want to fall to your death, but please. Please don't. I don't want to have to fight the birds again. The next one doesn't miss. Uthid? You're young for a bounty hunter. Or am I old for a soldier? I'm not here for the price on your head, Uthid. I believe you're innocent. Innocent? <laughs> Come on, then. If this is a trick, it's a good one. You've earned your kill. He doesn't even have an arrow knocked. Alright, that was... Cool, okay. No tricks. Just talk. Just instantly believes me. Alright, All right, that's fine. Speak. I want to know what happened at Sunfall. What really happened. Alright. For weeks, each dawn in the tent city came with a new death. Always in their sleep, no struggle. The old, the infirm, sometimes the young. Those who couldn't fight for the cause. I should have realized then it was a culling. Who would do such a thing? They thought it was a curse, an evil spirit. But it was only a man. And a silent poison. It took time to catch him, but we did. We brought him before Bahavas for the sun's judgment. The high priest Bahavas? He's the one who put the bounty on you. Yes. He thanked me for my diligence, then had his guards release the villain. You see? It was he who ordered the culling. Then they turned on us. Should have died with my men, so their loyalty meant something. Twenty years I gave to the sun. For what? Malice and murder? As for honor, sacrifice, true sacrifice, the kind priests and rulers know nothing of? It's all a fat joke. I can believe you're a good man. But why go with the Shadow Karja in the first place? Why serve them? Because of Edaman, of course. He was the one true Sun King. Edaman's just a child. Yes, an untainted vessel. I believed he was pure. Oh, that's kind of creepy. But they used him, used our faith. I can see that now. No shadows under a noonday sun. Bahavas didn't need to disgrace my name. I did it myself, serving a rotten throne. If it's honor you seek, the Sun Karjas seem trustworthy. A little stuck up, maybe, but trustworthy. Those Karja once raided your Nora lands. Raided every land we could reach. It was the Sun's will. I did what I was told. Others did worse. But as their captain, I had- Uthid, I don't care what you did. I, I can't absolve you, but the Karja are changing their ways. You could too. Perhaps. Avad doesn't understand what the sun demands of its soldiers. Perhaps he understands it too well. Now you sound like the blameless Murad. I met someone who wants to get you out of this. A woman named Banasha. But first Banasha. we need to get you out of here. Second A. What are you? You look like a hunter. You give orders like a soldier who's been out. What is a man? 
think they'll all line up to tell me I'm innocent? Should have stayed on the plains, Kaja! The mountains belong to us! Key Cook's killers! When we're done with Kika? you, you won't even leave an echo! You didn't make it hard to be followed. Almost as if you wanted to go out in a showdown. Not much gets by you. She's coming for us! Archers in melee. Ah! Ah! ah. Should have stood still. Yep, that's my own fault. It's up to you now, man. Rally, we can still finish them. Think you can finish me? Me? Aloy? Sniper without peer? I say as I miss like five consecutive arrows. This is why you aim for center of mass and not for headshots. Also why I, I say aiming solely for headshots. Ah crap! Down their defenses. I didn't stack up on me. That won't be the last one. Follow me. Yeesh. I stacked supplies up above. Alright. Now. We loot. Actually, they just have like pennies on them. And it's probably not worth looting. Dude, we can climb up the ledge without doing this. Up and over. Grab what you can while we still have time. Kind of a weird thing to make a cutscene. Honestly, I think it's just so it can like load the next part of this quest. Never know when I might need these. A robust defense is the most satisfying to break. All right, Marvels. We brought the priest out here, so let's put Marvel. on a show for him. Oh, shit. It's the Avengers. I know that, Hood. We've unfinished business, Bahavas and I. Ah, the Sun Pope is here. This will be difficult. I think you rallied to a lost cause. I don't intend to die today, Uthid. I did. But you're starting to change my mind. Okay, I don't want to get stuck up by melee again. Those guys. Take the fight to them! Your 
good, doing my good. My marvels thrive on adversity. Step it up, boys. Looks like they don't have Hawkeye, so I think we're, I think we're, I think we're pretty safe from all these archers. Yeah, uh, they. This is. This isn't even. This isn't like the B or C team. Marvel. Like this is the like uh, the JV Avengers. It's the uh, the farm team. Ow. Okay. They still have like bombs. Alright, good to know I can one two combo the heck out of them. Come on, you frog! Fight back! Oh jeez! Ow! Man, those uh those Mr. Strange monks are really good with their staves. That's the last of the marvels. Bahamas thought he had enough fodder to keep him safe. Now there's hope for justice. Will you come with me? Did I just accidentally use a full health potion? Dang it! I mean, I can afford them. I, I realize I can now buy them from that merchant, but it's still really annoying. This won't be easy. Bahava still has his personal guard. Yep, always threes is the one of the oldest oldest story trope. Three beats. <laughs> Yeah, he knows if I try to climb up myself, I just yeet off the cliff. Alloy's greatest weakness. The siren call of the void. Snow. It's not getting any warmer out here. I believe there's actually a a French word. I had to come here myself that. to end your suffering, Uthid. And mine. The Outlanders led us here. And now that they are dead, their price is most affordable. But enough with needles. It's time for blades. But enough talk. Remove them How from the you? sun's sight. Oh, that dude's got like a repeating bow or a uh, gun. Here I am. Nope, it's a gun. I shan't let you fall. Honestly, it's more like a owl. The sun. It's more like a uh, stack of roaming life. candles than a gun. Don't test me. Get okay, I can't two shot these guys. They actually have some defenses. Kill a traitor. Kill a Nora. This one's all mine. Right, now the full health potion is useful. Alright, I want this guy to stop shooting those roaming candles at me. Make it hurt! As the shadow falls upon them. Ow! Oh! Oh jeez, he can shoot me point blank too! Ow! Now I have the Roman candles. On your His superpower is uh, helping me up ledges. You know, it's niche, but you know, it's not about the overpoweredness of the superpower. It's uh, it's how you use it.
Whatever deal you worked out with him, I'll double it. More than double it. No. I'm tired of this, Bahavis. The lies and the violence in your cheap scented oils. I don't suppose you'd kill yourself. I had to. I had to. Prune the weak, or all the Karja in shadow are doomed. This solves nothing. But may the sun find some worth among your drying bones. Oof. Gutted him like a fish. That was quite a fireworks show. You took your time. I was busy. What do you think happened to Yan Shand, the other mercenary band? <laughs> and I had to organize passage to Meridian for a wanted man. Give us a moment, Uthid. Girl talk. <laughs> You've had quite a day. I never imagined Bahavas would blunder into his own trap. His death opens up wonderful possibilities. Remember Edaman and Nasadi? The Child King and his mother guarded like hostages at Sunfall? With Bahavas gone, no one will be watching them. I want to get them out. And I could use your help. Kidnapping the Sun King of the Shadow Karja is no small task. It's not kidnapping. They want to go to Meridian, to safety. Mm. How do you know that? I've been posing as Nasadi's handmaiden. She's scared. For herself, of course, but mostly for Edaman. Well, who's going to take over? What's going to happen at Sunfall now that Bahavas is dead? Oh, it will be glorious. Mm -hmm. The priests will panic. They'll be infighting, skullduggery, and backstabbing as they wrangle for power. Best of all, they'll be distracted. Bahavas, your life brought misery, but your death is a flower that blooms in abundance. What do you need to get Nasadi and Idaman out of Sunfall? With Bahavas dead, Sunfall is the easy part. I'll handle that. The big fuss will be crossing the border to the Sundom. Find my friend, Three Tohuadiv, near the branded shore. I hired his crew to sweep the path, so all you have to do is wait for me. If I mean, if he only has three toes, I don't think he's a good sweeper. Area, why do you need me? Contingencies, little huntress. Something will go wrong, and I need protection I can count on. You. I'll try not to disappoint. I kind of wonder what's gonna, the like, Nora if we get the... Help me. Are we bound for Meridian? Only if you want to go, my dear. What choice do I have? None at all. I was just being polite. <laughs> I like Vinasha. What makes you think Save a father would welcome trail. me after I served his end? 